Let's use a circular pipe as an example. This pipe is formed of three lines. Each line is dependent on the two other lines. So each of the three lines contain the same information. To see this information and modify it, click on the icon I. A dialog box opens containing information related to the pipe size, the flow, the level, and in the case of conduits, to the length. If you cut this line using the cut command in AutoCAD, AutoFluid automatically cuts the pipe to create two pipes. The first one is here, and the second one is here. This way, each pipe remains formed of three lines. This principle is the same for this pipe cut in half by text.